My name is Trevor Dudley. Uh, I'm an Ashoka Fellow. My name is Feris Marika. Hi, I'm Heather Cameron and I'm a change maker working in Berlin. I'm a change maker because I'm helping girls and women go through life with more security, with more confidence, with more ability to take control of their lives because they're learning self-defense and the beautiful sport of amateur boxing. I'm someone who was born in a family of 11 girls and you always felt depressed because there was a belief in a society that girls cannot do much, that even there's no need of girls going to school. So we felt we were being depressed about that. So by the time I grew up, I found out that I had my rights that I had to follow and there was no difference between me and a and boy. So this is why I developed this thing of using sports so as to get together many women at the same time and talk about our rights and our experience. The schools were coming under pressure to improve academic results and so sports was being pushed out of the window. And when I found that, I thought, um, mm, that's, uh, that, you know, that can be a real problem for Uganda. I found that many women were understanding this issue, so it didn't take me time to explain to them and to motivate them. But the only challenges we got is from the public and from the culture aspect of view. The people thought that only men could be supported, they thought that only men can be taken to school, only men could do sports, those are the challenges we made. I myself am a passionate athlete and know what being able to do sports was, was able to, to help me with my development, the opportunities to learn leadership skills, to learn to stand before a group with confidence and, and know-how and authority. In the end we got support from the government and everything was scheduled according to girls also. I was so surprised and happy to find out that I'd been awarded a Shoka Fellowship in 2003. That gave me the confidence uh, to move forward. Taking the idea from uh, one community into a national model, uh, and that has uh, allowed over 30,000 children now, boys and girls, to take part in sports programs uh, around the country. The vision I have for the future is that we must empower women through sports with education. Not only to take women just in doing sports and being physical active, but to use sport as a tool for education on different issues and different values. Sports is just such a natural attraction for children. Uh, we've only got to go into a village, uh, throw one football down, uh, and within five minutes you've got a hundred kids who uh, want to play sport. It's a magnet. I haven't invented a wheel, I haven't invented anything special. I'm just using the power of sport to be able to give those children the opportunity to improve their lives. I'm really excited to find more of these young women will themselves become change makers as they realize how sports and a bit of ambition and a bit of ideas for a different world will lead them forward. You have to have passion, that's the key word, passion. You've got to have passion and a drive. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.